What is your dream? Right now, yes, a place to live. I just want a place where I can go and I don't have to worry about moving again. We gotta, we gotta make sure that you have somewhere to go and we need to find a, so we need to see if we can find a solution this long term. Oh, that would be wonderful. That would be wonderful. So, so did you live here when the tornado hit? Oh, yes. This is where you lived? This is where I lived. Right here? Yes. In this unit? In this unit. Wow. Uh, and I thought I was going to lose my life when the walls started shaking and stuff. But I mean, it's Christmas. I know. And my great-grandson said, Grandma, I can't come see you on Christmas because Mama says you don't have nothing. And I said, honey, Right. I would like to go ahead and commit twenty thousand dollars for you. Oh. <laughs> We're gonna rebuild the dream, okay? Thank you. I tell everybody, don't give up. It's got to get better. We've already seen almost the worst thing that could ever happen. Hey, Miss Pam. I'm good. How are you? I'm doing better and better every day. Oh, tell me about it. The dream machine has helped me get my beautiful forever home with land. Yes! And it's beautiful. You it's like just it? Just beautiful. Yes, I do. It's beautiful. It is. Just don't know what to say. It's like a dream come true. Mm -hmm. And that's what it is a dream come true. Can we Go. give us a tour? Yes. This is beautiful. Wow. It's amazing. Isn't it beautiful? What's your favorite thing about the house, Miss Pam? Favorite thing about this house? It's mine! And I don't ever have to leave again! I don't know how to ever repay all these beautiful people. But grandson, Bentley, they said we can't come. Grandma, you don't have nothing. I have a home now. So when I can get straightened out, he's gonna come, be able to come stay with me again and I can't wait. I'm telling you, this is the most beautiful home I've ever seen. <laughs> because at least it's mine. <laughs>